Well, KXN's web team is all over this morning's big stories. All right, let's check in with Jackie Vega, who made it all the way from the web desk of the newsroom here to the studio this morning with a look ahead at what's being posted this morning. Jackie, good morning. Hey, good morning. Well, that's right. It was a long trek over here. Well, many <laughs> eyes are still on Tropical Storm as it continues to circle closer, and that means we're watching it for you also online in our Tropical section under our weather page. That's in addition to our in-depth information on our special hurricane tracker page, where you can see all of the storms so far this year. We'll also have a timeline up and running running later today on the eye of the storm, meaning all the big eye-named storms like Ike and Irene from 2001 all the way to 2011. And now on to the Samsung Apple battle. A federal jury in California ruled Samsung, the world's largest maker of phones, copied features of the iPhone and the iPad. And now consumers are left with a lot of questions, whether Samsung phones will be, still be available, whether they'll be more expensive, or if owners are existing uh, phones need to worry. You, know, you can check out a list of all what this means for you online now. And there's the the incredible story of a dog that went missing in Oregon and they actually turned up three years later in Utah. Sarah ran away when her owners went on vacation and left her with friends back in 2009. Now an animal hospital more than 800 miles away was, was able to find the owners because the dog was microchipped. So just a good reminder to get your dog microchipped. I have mine microchipped. So right. it makes me happy. Plus you can find Natalie's forecast um, online as long as you need it and also you can check our real-time traffic maps for any uh, road hangups this morning. In the studio, Jackie Vega, Cakes. All right, so glad Glad you're here, Jackie. Thank you. Yeah. You're welcome. All right.